Tomboy is a socially active and conscious clothing brand focusing on messages of social um, issues, mostly Black Lives Matter, feminism, homophobia. It really focuses on clothing people, making them look like themselves while really encompassing that positive energy and spirit. This business really found me because this is clothes that I used to wear. Um, you know, I would find something in a shop and I would modify it to make it look like what I wanted it to look like. And I found that a lot of people found interest in that. They'd ask me, where did you get this? Where did you get this? And then I decided, you know, I think there's an answer or a calling here. And I decided to go on myself and just create a clothing brand for people that want to look like themselves and not like a mannequin in a shop. I inspire young people by making them believe, first of all, that their dreams are valid. So whether it is a clothing brand you want to open, a beauty brand, whatever it is, my message says that, you know, I was in corporate as a nine to five person. In fact, I was a personal assistant for the longest time. And then I decided that there is this inkling to be something. And I hope young people can take me up on that challenge because yeah, as I said, three and a half years later, despite COVID and its challenges, um, the brand is still standing. The soft skills relevant for being an entrepreneur is really um, listening to your gut instincts and being sociable because a big part of entrepreneurship is interacting with people. So know how to listen to clients feedback or a mentor or somebody that's out there trying to help you position your brand the way you want it to be. So definitely listening and a impeccable work ethic if I may say so myself because people think that nine to five you work nine to five it's good because you get to go home but working for yourself you really work 365 days of the year so um, those are the skills that I think are relevant. What I would say to people that do not see beyond their circumstances or that they can see further is that to start something Basically, you have to believe that that thing is possible or the fact that you can do it. That's for me the fundamental thing. You, it will take people time to see the vision as you see it in your head. So you've got to surpass them by literally visualizing it and ensuring that nothing will stop in your way by means of solidifying it, you know, making your mindset, clarifying your mindset and saying, I'm going to do it despite the challenges that I'm going to face. And also um, looking around because there's plenty of evidence of success within our country itself of people that have really started something from nothing and have gone on to do great things. So believe that it is possible also with your own life. Um, my favorite motivational quote is yesterday, you said tomorrow. It always gets me going when I feel a little bit down or when I'm having a lazy day. Um, I always remind myself that each and every day I have to do something that takes me um, to the heights that I want to reach as a brand. I've been on Trace Academia, an absolutely wonderful app if I may say so myself. I'm very different to anything I've come across because of the diversity of the skills being offered there. You know, for people who are perhaps in their 9 to 5, they want to pivot their careers or people who are still not sure which direction they want to take in terms of their career, I would advise for them to download this app and really take time out. I mean, the courses on there, are you, it's easy to listen and the language is really accessible because it's not, there's no jargon or anything. People are able to understand it and you're able to make a decision there on which career you belong to. I mean, there's a diverse amount of um, courses being offered and I think it's a brilliant app.